Hi guys, is your Big Tree Tech Panda Touch giving you a hard time to turn on when connected with external power supply? If yes, then you need to watch this video. So stay tuned, guys. Hi guys, welcome back. My name is Rui and this is the Rui Raptor YouTube channel. If you want to help us out, you can by giving this video a like and subscribe to the channel. You can also help by joining our Patreon page or by clicking on any of the affiliate links posted below in the video description. So, a couple of months ago, we reviewed the Big Tree Tech's Panda Touch for the Bamboo Lab 3D printers. Some time after, we made a tutorial video explaining how to update the firmware. In this video, we will explain one issue that affected some initial units, including ours. The thing is that the unit works ok, except a few random times does not want to power up when connected with external power supply. When connected to the internal battery, it powers up just fine. We contacted Big Tree Tech's customer support reporting the problem and they sent us an updated power board that fixes the issue and which is already on the current Panda displays. So, let's go ahead and replace the power board. This board is located on the charger mount, so let's remove it from the display. There are only four Allen screws that we need to remove. Ok, here we have our board. If we compare both boards, they almost look the same. The new board has this date stamp on it and an additional component. The new component is this SMD Schottky rectifier diode, connected in series between the power input from the USB Type-C connector and the 5V Pogo pins connector. All we have to do now is install the new power board and tighten the four screws back. Ok, all done. Now, our Panda Touch turns on every time when connected with the external power as it was supposed to. So, if your Panda Touch has the same issue, you now know how to fix it. Hope this video was useful. We will see you guys next time. Bye!